vanilla sugar. It's so easy, it's so simple. If you saw my whipped cream video where I may used vanilla bean, this is the pod that was left. And what we need to do now is to get powdered sugar, a clean glass container, Just pour the sugar in. You can actually do this with use this with any other types of sugar. Hold on. There you go, because I don't have that. Okay. We're gonna Oopsie, spilling sugar. That's not a good thing. Ah! That's not a good thing. If you have OCD, that's going to make you feel very uncomfortable. Okay, there you go. If you have leftover vanilla bean from before, there, like that. See the specks? Wow, there's a lot. You put them in there with your sugar. By the way, you have to use your hands here when you're doing this. So make sure your hands are clean, guys. And it's not just clean like you wipe it. Make sure you really wash your hands. the side there may be more this it makes you in, like this way you're not wasting anything you're making use of every part of the vanilla bean out uh, of the pod and the bean you know why vanilla, vanilla bean is expensive wherever you are in the world even in America more so here in the Philippines. Did you know that one of this here in the Philippines is 275 pesos? And that's like how many meals for a family already? So you mix it up. That. You can actually shake it later. And as for the left, for this, what you're going to do is cut it, slice it in three. My knife is not that sharp. And there goes the tricycle. There you go. You put it in there. Okay. Put this in there. And what's going to happen now is you cover this see that there there it's like you're going to ferment the van the sugar with the vanilla shake it give it a shake so that everything is mixed. Make sure you don't drop the jar, especially since it's glass. If you're going to make more vanilla sugar and really fill this up, you should add like uh, at least two more vanilla bean pods. For this amount of sugar, one is enough. And it's not gonna be wasted because like you store this in a dark area like probably inside your cabinet that would be okay you store that for at least two weeks you shake it regularly once in a while and after two weeks you can use it and you can feel the taste and the hint of vanilla in your sugar it's good for coffee it's good for making whipped cream as well when you're using sugar you use this kind of sugar making whipped cream you don't have to add any more vanilla because this is already vanilla y tasting there you go so 
when you're almost like out, you could just add more sugar and let it ferment again. The vanilla bean is there to stay. There's your vanilla sugar, guys. I hope you enjoy this video. And you could learn by not wasting anything. Remember, waste not, want not. Vanilla sugar video. Bye. Thank you for watching, guys. Till next time.